what's up everyone welcome to keisha's corner this is a more early morning edition so a couple of weeks ago i painted my dresser let me show you guys well it won't allow me to turn around the camera but look let me show you so i painted that dresser gray and i got these new knobs that go on the bottom down here um, and kept the originals up here. I was missing one of the knobs, so I had to replace these down here. But I really wanted to keep the original knobs to make something be, you know, original from the dress or whatever. So I painted it. I love the paint that I use, but I need to go back and seal it. So I had to get some Mod Posh to seal the paint so that it won't be scuffed and chipped and scratches all over, which is what I am about to do today. Um, my pies, you could get this from like Walmart or, um, other craft stores or online. It's really hard to find right now quarantine because everyone is crafting. Um, so it took me a couple of weeks to get it, which is why I'm just now getting to it. And I will be back to show you what I am doing and how I'm doing it. All right. So it's been a few minutes. I already got the front part of the dresser done where the drawers are. I'm on the top and I'm going to do the side. It's very easy. You just kind of put a very smooth coat. Make sure that it's not gloppy like it is here, that you just smooth it out. And um, this is actually a glossy coat. I prefer matte, actually, personally. But they did not have the matte Mod Podge in stock. Um, they only had this glossy one. So I just figure I'll go ahead and do that. Um, so it goes on really smooth. Like I said, you don't want to use any glops here. It has the consistency of kind of like Elmer's glue. And I have used Elmer's glue for some projects before. But the problem with that is, is that if you get it wet or something, um, it does not last as long. So I would recommend using like Mod Podge. And I did order some Mod Podge outdoor also because I have some things that I want to paint and coat for outside and the Mod Podge outside helps it not be destroyed by like rainwater and stuff. So that is also an option if you wanted to do something like my table. I'm going to wait for that water one, that outdoor one to come in so that I could seal the table that I painted my dining room table. And I will let you guys see the finished product when it's dry. All right, so it's all done and dry. It looks really nice. I like the finish that I got. It looks a little vintage-y. It's glossy. I don't necessarily like the gloss, but hey, that's the kind of Mod Podge I bought. The way that I painted it, you could tell that some of the brown is still coming through. I only put one coat on there, and I did that on purpose because I like the way that it looked. And I think that my finished product looks really nice. So there we go. Another DIY project done in the books.